What is up everybody? Welcome back to another Molt Man episode. Back in the great state of New Mexico. I'm gonna ski with my wife's family, but if you've been a part of this channel at all, you know that I come and do a little fly fishing every year while we're here. So it's snowing, so I'm not gonna have the, it's actually really snowing. I don't know if y'all can tell or not, but I'm not gonna have the big camera out for too long. I'm gonna throw a GoPro on, but this is what we're working with right here. It's my favorite little hole right here. I don't know if they're gonna be there or not, but uh, you're allowed three trout per person. Mainly all we catch in this little river is uh, rainbow trout. But uh, we're gonna do a catch, clean, and cook for you guys, hopefully. Hopefully get on some fish. And uh, the water looks awesome. There's no wind this morning, just a bunch of snow. And the sun is trying to peek through. But it's supposed to be pretty, uh, pretty nasty all day. So this is another one of my little holes right here. When that sun comes up, you can see, sometimes you can see the trout down in there in those holes. So I'm going to get rigged up, throw a GoPro on, see if we can't catch a couple rainbows on this fine morning. It's 21 degrees, not super cold, but uh, I'm excited to get a line in the water and hopefully catch a few fish. So today I'm using an Orvis uh, three weight. I think this one's a three weight. This is a four weight. I got a three weight reel that I'm using. I got a three weight rod at the house, but I forgot it. So this is uh, this is my favorite rod anyway. The action on it is amazing. If you're curious, it's the Orvis Clearwater four weight. Awesome all around rod. I literally use it for everything so it's it's a really fun rod to uh, to fish for white bass and bluegill back at home and then for baits today we're probably gonna do double rig may use a little San Juan worm uh, probably a black leech and then maybe some little snow cones maybe a little uh, elk hair uh, what are they called? Elk hair, prints, something like that. So, we'll see what they're biting on. Hopefully there is fish in here right now. Tie that to the J in the hook of the leech. And then we'll tie on our snow cone below that itty bitty snow cone underneath that my hooks are sharp that's good so they're both weighted so they will get down uh, to the bottom we're not we're not dry fly fishing today unless I see them surfacing to eat but That's most likely not going to be the case. Let me go get a GoPro on and let's go get in the water. Do a little fish on. All right. Let's get down in one of these holes and see if we can't get some trout to bite.
just had a fish come up and follow it which is a good sign Gonna try a new spot. Got a bunch of hits at the last spot, but this looks like a good little hole. First fish of the day. Let's see if we can get him up here. Ah. I switched my rig up, took the snow cone off, and put on this little elk hair jig. Beautiful little trout. Perfect eating size. Got him unhooked. We're gonna throw him up right here in the snow. Beautiful little trout. I would say I matched the hatch, but I don't know what the hatch is, so. see if they'll eat it again. Oh, one just swiped at it. Let's get it back in there. Kind of just roll casting in this little it's a river but it's more like a texas creek size so it's kind of hard to really get good cast out so i'm just roll casting out into the middle of this backwash Well guys, we gave her our best today. Hit probably 20 different spots and changed my flies probably 30 different times. But got one for dinner and we had a ton of lookers. I actually hooked four or five other fish and they came off, but in the had to shoo a crow off of my fish. He got his got his eye out while I was fishing so fun day overall though a couple hours out here I think the bite just turned off I had so many fish come up and look at my bait and uh, they just wouldn't eat it so um, I'm gonna go run to the fly shop in town and see if they have any advice maybe come out here again before we head home but y'all leave it in the comments if y'all want to see a vlog style video of me and my family skiing for a day um, there's not a whole lot else to do. There's no hunting seasons open right now. So um, Y'all stay tuned. I'll see you back at the house. We'll get this fish cleaned up and prepare it. We're back at the house. Everybody's out snowboarding I'm about to do it after we cook us some lunch. So I got our fish I gutted him took his gills out and I got the grill fired up on high We're gonna take some critter glitter fish and fowl if y'all want to try this. This is the old bottle, but you can get it at maltman.net. 
it is linked in the description we have five different seasonings and uh this one is amazing on fish so y'all go get some and check it out so i'm seasoning it up pretty good and then i'm just gonna throw it right on the grill that skin will char up and that that skin will just peel right up and you can eat the flaky fish underneath so we're gonna let that cook for a while and then uh we'll check on it in a minute and give her an old taste test take a gander at our fish i cooked chicken last night so all the leftover chicken on there is smoking but fish is looking awesome nice and charred i already flipped it once let's see if this skin peels oh yeah skin's nice and crusty let's go ahead and take her off all right it is so bright out here the reflection off the snow is crazy but you can see how that skin just peels right back it's like the best backcountry meal ever fresh trout you just take your fork run it in that meat bon appetit let's see what it tastes like no bones that's actually that's one of the best trout i've ever had That's solid, solid, solid. Get a little seasoning on there. That's delicious. I'll give that a solid nine one for trout. That is, I'm really hungry too, so that could have a lot to do with it, but that is delicious. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Just a little catch, clean, and cook here in New Mexico. Uh, we got some more stuff coming, but like I said earlier, if y'all would enjoy it, a vlog-style video with the family, skiing on the mountain, Ryder's two years old, and got him a little snowboard. So we're about to take him up on the mountain. Uh, if y'all want to support the channel, go to moltman.net. Shirts, hats, hoodies, spices, and Moltman Bait Co. Baits. Y'all go over there, check that out. And if you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and the notification bell. And until next time, hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, and remember, eat good.